I don't think he should be paying all her bills though. That's doing too much. And giving her lump sums of cash in addition to child support and um, paying for the child to eat every single day. I mean, that it does seem like a little bit too much, y'all. What y'all think? I would be a little bit concerned about his real relationship with this woman. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gonna eat a little, drink a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no clickbait. Hey guys, it's Steph and I'm back with another video. Today you guys, I'm doing a king crab seafood boil drenched in seafood sauce. I'm so hungry. If you guys are new here, welcome to the family. Thank you for subscribing. If you've been here before, welcome back. I'm ready to get into the video. Y'all ready? Then let's get into the video. All right guys, I am back. So what I have today is king crab, snow crab, giant shrimp, potatoes, corn, and boiled eggs, you guys. I have some delicious sauce here that I'm gonna be dipping in and I am starving. Oh my goodness, I'm so hungry y'all, <laughs> for real. Like it's bad. So y'all see I'm doing a solo today. Tasha's out of town, she's been gone for three days already. I have barely eaten anything for the past three days y'all. So I'm, I'm, I'm like really hungry. Mm. I ain't gonna even try to crack into this crab yet, crab leg yet. Cause I'm just too hungry, y'all. I'm, I'm really, really hungry. I need something that I can eat right now. Mm. I might have to do a dope, no wipe my mouth challenge this time, y'all. So I don't have time for these napkins. Mm. Oh, this is so, so good. Take a bite of this potato in honor of my baby. Mm. I'm going to do a volcano, y'all. Let me just get some food in my stomach. Oh, what am I doing? I have to suck the shrimp first. Somebody was watching Tasha's video the other day <clears throat> and they got mad because she didn't suck it first. Well, I'd be getting mad too. I'll be in the background, suck it, suck it. Mm. Mm -hmm. So y'all, the family has officially grown to over 200,000 subscribers, you guys. That is so amazing. We really appreciate you guys. We love every single one of you. Old and new. Keep rocking with us, y'all. Keep giving us all the love and support that you've given us so far. Keep us going, y'all. Mm. Mm. What should I get into first? I kind of cracked the crab legs open a little bit so I wouldn't be messing around too much. Oh, oops. A little small piece of king, king crab. Well, let me grab my um, lemon out of here. Get that going. Mm. So my cousin Rhonda is coming over today. She's gonna keep me company for the next few days. And you guys, for every, anybody who um, knows Rhonda, my cousin, she's been on the channel before, and who likes her, then you guys will be happy to hear that. I think I have finally convinced her to start her channel, you guys. So we're gonna be recording some videos 
this weekend for her channel. I'll put a link in the um, pin comment. I'm probably going to forget, so just remind me. <laughs> I'll definitely put her um, channel name in the video somewhere. Probably here. But sometimes it's hard to find people just searching their name when they're new. So y'all might need the link. But try it. Try it without the link if I forget. Ah, snow crab. Yes. Yes, beautiful baby. So today, you guys, I'm doing a um, viewer topic. If you guys want to submit any topics to us or just talk to us on um, Instagram personally, feel free to DM us at Steph and Tasha. We also um, have a Facebook. However, we really don't check that as much, you guys. If you do leave us a Facebook, then tell us like on, on the video comment that you did and we'll look at it right away. Ooh. Oh, I don't want to break my nails. I need to get in this. Yes. Oh, man. It's flying everywhere. Everywhere, y'all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm always afraid that I'm going to cut my chin, my uh, tongue on this crap. Is it just me? <clears throat> so the viewer topic is kind of long, y'all. So I'm going to try to paraphrase it a little bit as I'm reading it. Mm. But I'm sure somebody out there can relate to this. So I just open up the Big Daddy. Y'all ready? See, I had it ready. Y'all like that? I didn't have to do so much cracking. Look at him. Look at him, y'all. Mm -hmm. um. Gotta add the extra lemon on it. Yes. Oop. I want to get into my story, but before I do, I gotta do this with my baby, y'all. Gotta get this volcano. I might have to clip this if I um take too much time. So don't trip, don't trip. Got the here's the shrimp. I'm gonna do half because my mouth ain't like her crazy mouth is. Oh, this is getting messy, y'all. <laughs> y'all know I like this. That's crazy, huh? Woo! He came right out, y'all. But I'm breaking half. <laughs> Go figure. The, the time when I need it small, it would come all the way out, right? All right, so all I have, I don't have no potato, um, no sausage, y'all. So we're going to do this for my baby. I love you. I miss you so much, y'all. I miss her. She's so insane. I don't know how she does that all the time. It's so delicious, don't get me wrong, but I just cannot stand to have that much stuff in my mouth at once. Mm. Mm -mm, look at this. Already. I'm not even halfway done, y'all. You know what? This is going to be hard for me to actually read the story, y'all, because <laughs> I ain't trying to mess my um, phone up like that. So let me just, I, I know, ow, ow. These things are dangerous, y'all. If you ain't messing with crap, be careful, okay? You can come out bleeding after you finish eating. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I know, I remember some of what I read about this topic, so I'm gonna go ahead and just tell you some of it. So I don't have to. I don't know that. Well, nobody talking to you. Alexa always coming on, ain't nobody said nothing about her. No, yeah. Mm. Okay, so I, I remember that she has been with her. Okay. Alexa, goodbye. 
Goodbye. I always interrupted our video. She now when I need her to do something, she don't, don't know what what I'm talking about. Okay, she's been on this the person the viewer topic. She's been on um and off with her boyfriend for I believe six years. They lived together. She said for the first four years, he was actually. In a previous relationship, so their relationship was kind of like an open relationship for the first four years. She has a child, I mean, he has a child with the previous woman, and now they also have a child. He also has, he has four children all together, and then also he's the stepfather of one of her older kids. Okay, y'all with me? Hope I'm doing this right. I'm really trying to remember um, everything. <clears throat> I'm probably going to get my phone in a second because I don't remember that much more. I know there's some issue with him and how he's dealing with his other, his other baby mama. Our viewer... Basically feels like he's doing too much, y'all. She's like, he's already paying child support. Why does he have to do all this extra stuff? Because she said that he's like paying the girl's bills. They're having to like pick the child up every day and feed it. Feed him or her. I don't call it it. But you know what I'm saying. I don't know if it's him or her. So that's why I said that. So they're having to basically feed the child every single day. He's giving the lady lump sums of money and then in addition to the child support and paying some of her bills basically. What y'all think about that? Let me go get my phone. So she says he picks the child up every weekend, which means that him and her, now she's saying this, I'm not this up. She said, which means that me and him barely get to spend any adult time together. Um, they've also been picking the child up from school every day and, and buying food. Um, he's basically catering to the other woman just like she would want him to cater to her. Okay. Um, paying paying bills giving her lump sums of cash paying child support of course you know we already know he has to pay child support um but she's just saying okay so she's saying that she is having to pick up the slack with the bills in their household because he's giving more money than he should be giving to his other baby mama okay so she also has an issue with the fact that she thinks the other baby mama is using her child to spy on them she doesn't really say what the child is going back and telling her, but she she is saying that she says that the lady has stalked her home at one point. Um, she's addressed her boyfriend, and he doesn't really take any any of this seriously. He basically feels like he should cater to his baby mama and give her whatever she wants. Um, I guess he wants to keep the peace and just make sure everybody is happy and satisfied. So he is just like whatever she asks for, let me just give it to her so she can leave me alone, and that's it. You know, at least that's what he telling her. Okay, so she's basically like, she wants this stuff to end. She wants her, him to have a regular, healthy um, parenting and co-parenting relationship, but not be treating her almost like she's the other woman, you know? Um, and she's like, I still love him. I want to be with him, but I just don't know what to do. He's basically ignoring her, all of her concerns. Okay, so what y'all think? Is anybody else dealing with something like this? Do you guys think that you should... How much more do you think someone should do other than child support? That's that's the question. Because there's always, I mean, there's there's already an amount that he's paying for child support, but how much more should he do? Sometimes the child support, honestly, I don't think it is enough. Maybe it's, sometimes maybe it's too much. I don't know. But I know, like, somebody was saying they were only getting, like, two like $200 for child support. Like, that's not enough to take care of a kid. I'm sorry. So, if the dad is doing a little extra... I wouldn't be upset. I don't think he should be paying all her bills, though. That's doing too much. 
all, paying all her bills and giving her lump sums of cash in addition to child support and um paying for the child to eat every single day i mean that it does seem like a little bit too much y'all what y'all think i would be a little bit concerned about his real relationship with this woman because you got to remember too when y'all first started dating for the first four years he was in a relationship with both of y'all so what makes you think he's really out of it with her now he probably still in a relationship with her girl only difference is he living with you now he ain't changed nothing but his address in y'all situation that's what i think what y'all think i'm just saying what i think okay i could be absolutely wrong but it sounds to me like when y'all started dating he was living with her y'all were in an open relationship they probably got into it fell out then he moved with you then they got back together and worked it out and now he's back with both y'all but living with you that's why he's taking care of so much of her stuff i don't think there's that many men out there that's gonna pay their baby mama's whole bills i just i don't think so not voluntarily what y'all think anybody out there getting their whole entire bills paid by the baby daddy in addition to child support oh that's annoying now what should you do is a whole different answer y'all what should you do the great thing about life is that we are in control of everything that happens to us because we can leave the situation okay so you always have the option to leave if you're with somebody they're not treating you right they're not treating you how you think you want to be treated or how you deserve to be treated you can even easily leave especially if you already have discussed issues with them and they ain't about to change it so at this point the only thing you can do because you've already talked to him is either accept it or get out he ain't about to stop because he wants to take care of his baby mama that's what he wants i believe he wants both of y'all and unless you want to sit there and share a man for the rest of your life i think it's time to leave y'all what y'all think is there any other solution to this you guys to where she would actually be happy let her know in the comments because i can't think of one okay we all here to help each other i don't know everything somebody's treating you in a way you don't deserve to be treated is going to trickle down on every part of your life most likely because if you're not happy you're going to take that unhappy energy everywhere you go and we need to stop it we need to get ourselves happy it's okay if these relationships don't work y'all okay if there was ever a long period of time that i was unhappy with my wife we would have to break up okay now i ain't talking about oh, we got an argument but i mean if there's a long period of time and i'm trying to work it out and there and she's like i don't see any problem and i'm unhappy I'm not doing that forever. For what? Why would I do that forever? Leave. This is a entire mess. Y'all can see down there though. <laughs> mm. Mm -mm -mm. I don't think I've ever eaten this much, y'all. There's barely anything left in my mouth. Except some lemon and lime. And a couple of potatoes that I'm not going to eat. Oh, thank you to everybody who... I'm not even going to say. Because I don't want nobody trying to do no stuff. But I'm just going to say this. Thank you to everybody who left Blue Hearts in the video. You know what I'm talking about. And uh, we're we going we gonna to handle y'all very soon when Tasha gets back. Okay? I love y'all so much. I really do. Me and Rhonda probably going to go live tonight. So hopefully y'all had your post notifications on two or three days ago, which is today for me. Um, and you get the notification. If not, turn them on now because we go live probably once a week at least. And y'all don't want to miss it because we be lit. Okay? I'm about to get up off this video, y'all. Because guess what? I barely have any food. For one. 
Number two, I'm actually getting full. I'm not eating these potatoes. That sauce is a bomb. This is a boiling crab mild sauce. But I take as much of the butter out as I can and mix it with water. Because I ain't trying to eat all that butter, y'all. Bye, y'all. I can't even do it. I'll try y'all. Thumbs up. Love y'all. Peace. Is <clears throat> that for real? <laughs> y'all really eat all my snow crab? Now, I never eat all the snow crab, y'all. So, I was like, I ain't getting two snow crabs this time. Oh, I told that thing up. Oh. Throw it up. I'm so good. Gone. I think me and Roger are doing the seafood boil tomorrow, so I'll get some more tomorrow. Mm. I'm gonna eat every inch of that's the that's the crab. Every inch. I don't leave no meat in my shit like Tasha. Ain't nothing in these about things, y'all. Hear that? If you can blow that shit like a whistle, you know you eating right. Pure air. Again. <laughs>